Uh, now to the latest in a mystery that rattled a downriver community for weeks. A mystery foam that oozed onto the road in Melvindale back in August. Well, after extensive testing, we have some answers. Jason Colthorpe is here with us now, and we still may not know exactly where it came from, but we do know what was in it, Jason. We know exactly what was in it. Yeah, it's a highly concentrated level of PFAS, and health officials and water officials say that's a pretty good lead in figuring this all out. It was the mystery substance that baffled first responders and anyone else in Melvindale driving along Schaefer Highway last summer. It smelled and oozed, and for days there were guesses as to what it was and where it came from. Today, the Great Lakes Water Authority knows that substance was loaded with PFAS. The chemical compounds that have been around for 80 years and are found in products like Scotchgard and other industrial materials. But likely not the fault of nearby Norfolk Southern Railroad or Marathon Oil. Best guess right now by the Great Lakes Water Authority is the substance found out here was a triple F foam used mostly by fire departments and the military. They still have to do some investigating to pinpoint where the source was. But the number one goal right now is to locate if there is any residual material out here and clean that up. The Melvindale fire chief was unavailable today and the assistant chief declined to comment on this new information. There is a possibility of fines or other penalties, but that depends on what the rest of this investigation turns up.